Hello everybody, uh, it's me, Create, Animate, Terminate. Today I'm gonna make a review on some Lego Marvel, uh, Marvel Studios. I don't know why I said Marvel twice, whatever. Uh, CMF, what if, uh, or just a bunch of series figures. I'll call them Disney Plus figures, cause, yeah, I'm pretty sure all of these figures are from Disney Plus. So here are the three I have, Zombie Captain America, um, T'Challa Star-Lord, and, well, I watched What If, but I didn't, I only watched one episode of WandaVision, the first one, so I'm not sure who the last one is. But, so I opened three of those, and my mom just said here, and she gave me a fourth that was supposed to be for Christmas. But I have a fifth, so I guess I'll open that on Christmas. So let's see what's inside. Crap. <gasps> Gamora Thanos, no way. Bro, wait, so all of them are new characters. I haven't gotten one duplicate, surprisingly. That's great. Alright, I'll build her. Give me a second. So, here she is. Looks pretty cool. And I don't get what Lego was thinking when making this series. Because they... They should have made all the characters from What If, so they could make a What If Ultron. They should have just made one series for What If, um, th and one series from Captain America and the Wo No, not Captain America, jeez, Falcon and the Winter Soldier. They would have had enough minifigures for that, and WandaVision. Th that all would have worked. They would have had enough figures. Because then we could have gotten, uh, Ultron. Because, yeah, just yeah. I have two characters from that Avengers team in that last episode. T'Challa and Gamora. So, I have four of all the characters already, and there are, give me a second, 13 characters. So, four, so nine characters left. Um, and I have one more bag, but I'm not gonna open that one. And hopefully I get Spider-Man. Yeah, Spider-Man. Or Bucky. Yeah. So, these are really cool. Starting off, let's look at T'Challa. Yeah. So, here's T'Challa Star-Lord. Looks pretty cool. He has a nice looking uh, purple coat sweater thing. I remember watching this before making that Thanos uh, stop motion. Yeah, this is when the guest the guest was over. And yeah, so I recorded. I made the audio from that scene. So uh, here's T'Challa next to Thanos because he's a... Thanos' companion, because Thanos has changed his mind about wiping out half the universe. Maybe Star-Lord should have been T'Challa. Seems like a way better world. Yeah, and my favorite character of that episode was obviously good Thanos, because who doesn't like that idea? Love the I'm, I'm not crazy on Matt thing reference to the whole, his, the whole name of him, Thanos in the comics, the Matt Titan. So, this is a cool character. I really like this figure, too. It looks great. I used to have a normal Star-Lord, but he fell apart. So, yeah, I guess this is a good addition. I'm flying. Pew, pew, pew. Dead. Oh, uh, let's go to the next character. So here's my most favorite out of what I got, and I think out of like the whole series, like the Spider-Man's pretty basic, everyone's pretty basic. I got my top most wanted, Zombie Captain America. This thing, and I got this in my first bag, and it was my most wanted, and I got him for seven dollars um in the store in the blind bag, but he was fourteen dollars on Amazon alone, and but I got him out of a bag first try from a store. And very cool detail. Nice torn shield. I have a normal Captain America too that's similar to that. And I got it recently too. But 
I don't want to make put that in this video because I made a, a different attempt on this video where I just opened this character after buying these two. I went back to the store and bought more for Christmas and just one more for that day. And yeah, that video ended up being 20 minutes long. I don't want to put my number in. Give me a second. So here is whoever this is. Sorry. Um, if you know her name, please comment it. I don't know. I didn't watch much of WandaVision. But I'm pretty sure she had gained some kind of powers at the end. I don't know. I remember watching film theories talk something about it. Um, anywho, but she's a pretty good figure. It's decently detailed, and then there's a helicopter. Dead. Or drone. I don't know what this thing is. There's a non-purpose... Like, this flight sand makes no sense, so I made the... Like, it doesn't belong here. Why is it here? So I just made the helicopter flying sideways because there's no other way to attach it. And it looks kind of cool. So, okay. Let's see what's next. I don't know why I did that voice there. Um, So here's the one I just opened in front of you guys. Thanos Gamora. This is also a really cool figure. It's very detailed. Since we have Thanos Gamora here... Let's get her next to Thanos. Um, give me a second. Uh, okay. So here's the Infinity Gauntlet with no stones. That's why I want to get the Advent Calendar. Because it has all the stones. And then here's Thanos. So, okay. Cool. That's and she comes with an extra handle. Pointless. You can't even attach it to the other handle to make it longer. See how Thanos looks holding this small blade. This small one. It's for it won't look that good, that's for sure. Eh, I've seen him hold worse. I mean, he cuts his knee off. Cool. Dead. So, yeah. Yeah. Thanks for watching this video. Um. I got a cool display going on here. Gamora stabbing Cap's shield. Cap block, well, zombie cap blocking it. Uh, Star Lord shooting, and that woman throwing her drone. Sorry that I called her woman. You might take that offensive or whatever. But no, I was just referring to her because I don't no idea what her name is, and they didn't put in the checklist. Nothing on this side. I don't believe there's anything on the other side. You know, just how to build her drone. Okay. Yeah. Um, that's it for this video. Subscribe. Like. Bye.